What's up guys? Welcome back. It's me Ayla again. Welcome to another vlog. So, for today's video, um um meron nag-asa kin kung is it safe ba dito sa Mexico and do I work here? I said no. And yes, um so, sa, may nagtanong sa akin, guys, kung yung dalang, dalawang question, guys. So, yeah. So, first is, is it safe here in Mexico? Lots of people said, even my, the sister of my grandmother, she said that it's really not safe here because it's a cartel country. Yeah, and even here to where I live right now or where we live, last week, we heard about our neighbor that someone robbed their house and get her phones, iPad, and money. And in, in the other, and in the two, I mean two, um, hot, I mean, in, the, in, in our left side is a hotel, a big hotel, and it is a golf, I mean, the world glass golf over in, in our left side got left side um um they almost got robbed too and there is a police so they shoot the three robbers so yeah so they kill them and here too in beside us in the right side which is clam beach la i mean they are the first one who robbed before us over here in our area so yeah and the other day guys there is a guy i mean the, i mean yeah we just saw a police so they said that they just dumped the guy in the in the in the road so yeah and he's he's died and they put them into a they put a rope and in a tarpaulin or whatever is that and they dump into the road and and beside that mexico is nice and cheap too guys and yeah it's crazy country but i don't have a choice guys because this is the only country that i can enter and yeah and they gave me six months here and my six months was expired already um on march 25 guys but they still let me stay here because I told them that I talked to the highest position guy in immigration that I don't have a choice because I need to flu fly from here to Hong Kong to China to Tokyo and that's the only that's the only place or country that I can enter because it's the only place that I'm I'm free visa either so yeah and they said oh no need to worry because of the virus and blah 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 so yes i'm happy to hear that and and yeah so let's back guys so sabi ng lula ko guys um be careful because yeah it is a cartel country and it is really scary guys because um and last time too guys like two weeks or one week ago there is one guy at the, our at our back that he wants to come in and get some of our stuff because our garage is open and we did not notice that or we forgot to close it so and he almost got our things here and i don't know guys because i just hear this going that like these people here they said lots of people like that when it's summer so it's almost summer guys so yeah scary so yeah but um most that it's i like here i want to live here forever guys but it's scary and we live in in front of the beach so it's so nice and we always run every day every morning and except if if there's rain if there is a rain and and there is a pool here and it's complete guys because except if there's a lot of people coming here guys because they are so loud and we don't like that 
because we pay here and we're silent people here and yeah so next question are you working or am i working here in mexico um big no because i'm just a tourist here for two months and i'm with my fiance and <laughs> Sorry guys, naantok ako guys kasi kakatapos ko lang maglinis sa labas guys. Na, kasi nagkakat sila ng palm tree. So yeah. So, next is, yeah, I mean yeah, I'm with my fiancé and waiting for my student visa to Canada. And I hope um, they will accept me. And, and I'm just here for a... Um, just just waiting for my visa and last time that we apply a student visa i mean us visa but supposed to be um if they accept me um uh, we travel in us right now but they didn't accept me so yeah so i'm here for a tourist only and we travel a lot already in cancun guadalajara um, what else? Um, I've been I've been in Mexico City too, and and what else? Because we drove from Chapala, Guadalajara, from from Guadalajara to here in Tijuana, guys. We drove that for five. I mean, I think five five or six days, guys. So yeah, and. The Ch Chihuahua, the very, very, and the most scary place, guys, the Chihuahua. And on that place, we got, um, I mean, someone shut our window. And while while my fiance driving, and someone shut, beside, I mean, someone shut on his side, the window side. So, yeah, but it's still good and still yeah because when we did not no one killed and kill and yeah so yun guys so di ako nag work dito nagte travel lang ako dito at kasi may ano din kami my rv kami dito dalawang rv at apat na truck limang truck guys tapos Ayan, tapos my garage pa guys. So, kasi mas, ano guys, mas mabuti kasi dito guys. Kasi walang vial. I mean, di katulad ng US. Kaya maraming taga US or, or Americans live here guys. Living here guys because it's cheap. And all is cheap guys. And even right now guys even the gasoline it's instead of 22 they they low make it low into 13 guys diesel is 13 pesos and yes guys it's cheap and not all that and we're near to into the into the u.s border to like one hour or um one and a half if there is no traffic and and yes guys so maganda din dito guys even me guys even even na first time ko pa dito guys na gusto ko nang tumira dito guys pero uh, nakakatakot din minsan wait guys ino muna ako kahit nga sabi nila guys nakakatakot pero the more you stay here ano na ano mo na guys feeling mo na taga dito ka na so at ano lang din guys suppose um they are all, we are almost same here in Philippines and here in Mexico or in Tijuana and sorry guys lagi kong nakatingin sa labas kasi nagkat kasi kami ng ano guys ng palm tree tapos Parang may bird sa ilalim ng mga leaves, guys. Na tinatapo namin. 
So, yes, guys. Yun, guys. So, and, yeah. So, I think, guys, that's all for today. And don't forget to like and subscribe. And if you have any suggestion or um, any things that you want me to do, um, let's see. And enjoy watching, guys. And thank you.